All is well, but the tale is not yet complete. While pursuing Doctor Doom, your actions have had ramifications you could not possibly imagine. Allow me to show you the future you helped to create. You chose wisely in saving the Omega Base computer. It contained research data on the Legacy Virus, a disease that is deadly to mutants. In several years, that information will lead to a cure and stop the plague. With one random act of bravery, you saved the entire mutant race from possible extinction. You showed true courage in locating the ingredients needed to heal Namor in Atlantis. Because of this, Namor will grow to trust surface dwellers. And in time, he will aid in the formation of a worldwide organization of superheroes. This group will save the Earth from many dangers that would have otherwise destroyed it. It was quite valiant of you to rescue Senator Kelly, a known detractor of mutants. Because of your kindness, the Senator will successfully sponsor the Mutant Aid Bill. This will allocate government funds for schools like Professor Xavier's. These schools will prove to be very effective in training young mutants in how to control their powers. It was most unfortunate that you were unable to rescue Jean Grey in Mephisto's realm. For she does not die in the Infinity Vortex. Instead, she returns to Earth in the form of the Dark Phoenix, to take vengeance upon those who did not save her. to locate the Sword of the Valkyrie. With her aid, Asgard is easily freed, but more importantly, Loki is imprisoned. And with the God of Mischief in chains, Ragnarok, the end of the Asgardian dimension, never comes to pass. It was most fortuitous that you found Vola's ring. This pleases the Asgardian prophetess such that, in years to come, she will warn Odin of an attempt on his life. This will lead to the capture of the villainous fire demon, Surtur. Saving Princess Lalandra was a very wise decision. In time, the Shi'ar will give Earth advanced technology that will wipe out all disease and hunger. Eventually, this new technology will even allow humanity to colonize other planets. You are to be congratulated on saving the Skrull planet from destruction. Soon, the scroll will form a tentative partnership with Earth. Shortly after that, the scroll will come to the aid of Earth when the Kree threaten to enslave humanity. It was most wise of you to save Odin from his confinement in Castle Doom. In the near future, the mighty Thanos will seek to conquer Earth only intervention by Thor's father will save the human race from enslavement. You are to be congratulated 
for locating the damaged Ultimate Nullifier at Castle Doom. One day soon, Mephisto will seek to conquer our dimension. But Reed Richards will repair the Ultimate Nullifier and use it to stop the vile creature before all is lost. Although this timeline was created by you, know that it can be altered. For you are a hero, and your every action, or inaction, affects the entire universe. So, uh, I just read these pages into the mic here, huh? Yeah, just be careful you don't get too close. Uh, speaking of getting close, what are you doing after work? I, uh, beg your pardon? Let's face it, there's an attraction here that neither of us can deny. <laughs> Mr. Stark, why don't we just stay focused here, okay? Oh, I'm focused, all right, little lady. You have my full attention. I could not help but notice Daredevil was here earlier. How is he being used in this video game about me? Um, it's not just about you, Namor. There are other superheroes in the game as well. <laughs> uh, oh, uh, are you being serious? Yeah, there's Wolverine and Spider-Man and Thor. A lot of different characters. I would think this to be a waste of time. Why would anyone wish to play any hero but me? Uh, hold, hold on a sec. Uh, Chris, uh, excuse me, one sec. What is it, Thing? Yeah, could I have some water? All this talking, it's making my voice gravelly. <laughs> gravelly, get it? Gravelly. <laughs> oh, ah, never mind. Thanks, Spider-Woman, that was great. Iceman, you're up. Wait, don't let Iceman in the booth yet. Hey, Spider-Woman, how was the... Whoa, marry me. Huh. Uh, sorry, Bobby. Voice acting is stressful for me. My pheromones got a little out of control. No problem. Hi. Is... is that Thor? Yes, he came a little early for his voiceover session. <gasps> oh, um, is there another door out of here? No. Sorry, Loki. Oh, this is terrible. Oh, when he sees me, he's going to just... Oh, hello, Thor! <laughs> it's pretty funny how I glued your hammer to the floor this morning, huh? <laughs> yes. Ha, ha, ha. It was very amusing. You didn't get it! Everyone back away from the nuclear bomb. Sue and I will handle this. You said the word wrong, Reed? It's nuclear. Yeah, I know. Nuclear. You did it again. It's pronounced nuclear. That's just what I said. Nuclear. Ah, uh, hun. <laughs> Listen to me. It's nuclear. You're adding a U in there. Look, I've got four advanced degrees in physics. I should certainly know how to say nuclear. I am so excited to be here. I I've never done voiceover work before. I'm sure it'll be just fine, Electra. Now, if you just say your first line. From uh, this paper here? Sure. All right, if we're all ready to go, this is take one. And? Daredevil, how I've missed you. If only they were... Hey, Kia! Oh, I'm so sorry. He he came up behind me and I reacted without thinking. Who is he? You just knocked out Devin, our sound engineer. A haiku by my good friend Oz. <clears throat> I hate broccoli and think it totally sucks. Why is it not meat? Well done, X-Men. The mission was successful. Uh... Sorry, Professor Xavier, but could you say that line one more time? Our, uh, writer Bob would like you to be a little angrier. Not to be difficult, but why must I repeat every line ten times? I know it's overkill, but Bob wants you to get the character right. How could I get it wrong? I am the character. Look, I'm sorry, but he'd like you to do it again. 
Robert, this is Professor Charles Xavier, and I am in your mind. If you do not cease this senseless repetition, I will force you to revisit memories of your schoolyard fight with a bully named Knuckles. Hey, uh, Professor X, Bob just had a change of heart. He is absolutely fine with how you said that last line. Somehow I knew he would. Hello, Colonel Fury. Welcome to the voiceover session. It's good to be here. I just... Wait a minute, what? what's this? Somebody, call security! There's no time. I'll have to handle this myself. Take that! And a little bit of this. How about one of these? And for the rest of you, some lead! Colonel, what just happened? Evil ninjas. They just won't leave me alone. Goodness. I apologize. Maybe if I stood sideways. That was my fault. I'll pay for that. Honest. Galactus, you're too big. Get out of the booth. I should probably call my agent. Okay, Weasel, it's break time. Come back in five. All right. Hey, cool. A data port. Uh, Weasel, don't touch that. Relax, I'm a hacker. I'm great with all this high-tech stuff. No, Weasel, please, get away from that. I have got it covered. Watch, when I... I'm the best at what I do. Okay, Wolverine, um, can we try it again with a little more feeling this time? I am the best at what I do. Mm, not quite, uh, one more time for luck. I'm the best at what I do. Oh man, this is tough. Oh, you're close. You're very, very close. You just need to dig down a little deeper and show us the real Wolverine. Right. Uh, now, what was I supposed to say? <sighs> Welcome, Black Panther. It's an honor to have royalty here. Please, I am just a simple man who happens to rule a country and battle evil on a daily basis. So if you just look at your lines on the stand in front of you there? Of course, I have them... Wolverine was the last one in this room, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. How did you know? It smells of cheap cigars and beef jerky. Okay, uh, Dr. Doom, that completes your lines for the game. Thanks very much for coming in. And thank you, Chris. I found this entire endeavor to be quite enjoyable. So much so, in fact, that I've begun to take acting lessons. <laughs> uh, really? Um, well, good for you. You're quite a natural at it. Yes. Unfortunately, my first acting coach didn't think so, so I had him thrown in a dungeon. My second coach was even less enamored with my acting talents, so I had him tortured and then thrown in a dungeon. As for my latest coach, I had him tortured, thrown in a dungeon, and then... Well, let's just say he's in a happier place now. Okay, Gene, I need you to focus on this one. It's gonna take a lot of emotion because this is actually where you die. Wait a minute. I die? Why do I always have to be the one who dies? I don't know. It isn't right. And frankly, it's getting to be really, really annoying. Maybe I should have a little chat with the associate producer! Thanks for coming to record your lines today, Iwatu. Will I not be recording lines for battle? I am quite certain people would find it most entertaining. Uh, no. Sorry. At heart, I am an action hero. Listen. It is clobbering time. Anyone else want a piece of me? Thanks, Awatu, but, uh, no. No, no. Get this. I am the best at what I do. Rrr. Don't make me call security. I say thee nay. Oh, sorry I'm late for the session. I had another late night. <sighs> Mephisto, that's the third time this week. What's the deal? Oh, you know, just out with old friends. But you're from a different dimension. How many people could you possibly know here in Hollywood? You forget. I make deals with people for their astral souls. Oh, that's right. In that case, you must have a lot of good friends here in town. All right, everybody. That's a wrap.
Bess? Black Widow, where are you? Not to worry. Did you do as I asked? Yeah, I grabbed Fury's brainwave pattern from S.H.I.E.L.D.'s medical database. Excellent. Did you upload the information to my laptop? <sighs> yes, it just finished. Now where are you? That, I am afraid, will have to remain a secret. But if S.H.I.E.L.D. finds out what I just did, they'd hunt me down like a dog. Yes, I imagine they would. I have one last thing I require from you, Weasel. Then our business will be concluded. Anything. Just name it. I need you to take the fall. You're under arrest by the authority of S.H.I.E.L.D. Black Widow, you can't do this to me! Get down on the floor! Now! No!